I done seen it all. That's right, I done seen it all, man. All, all, all. Do you realize that there's a company that's offering paid days for J's? Payday J's. Will you lease Air Jordans? Lease Air Jordans. You don't buy them straight out. You have to lease them. Because maybe you can't afford to buy them. So they want to make it affordable for you to go buy some Air Jordans. And people are buying it. Listen here. If you, if you live with your mother, do not have a job that pays you over $500 a week. You have no business. And I mean a job, a legal job too. A legal job that doesn't pay you over $500 a week. You have no business buying no damn Jordans. Don't buy no dang Jordans. Nope, no Jordans for you. You don't need Jordans. You need to buy a library card. I'm so sincere. Why do you care about your shoes so much? Why? Why do you care about your shoes so much? Buy some books. Buy some books. This company, a firm, name of this company, a firm. Yeah, that's it, a firm. Based out of San Francisco, California, is a tech company that's out here to bleed you dry and take all your money. Have you paying two years on one pair of shoes? And if you miss a payment, they screw up your credit. And the credit rates are between 10% and 30%. 10% is the best you can do. You can get a credit card with one, you can get a credit card with 1%. You do know that, right? So they're already preying on people who can't get a 1% credit card or 2% credit card. 10% is the best you can do. 30 is the high side. You understand what I'm saying? They are going to be raping people who can't afford it. This is focused on poor people. Because we're only a poor person will go up to a shoe store talking about, I can't afford the shoes, let me go ahead and pay on them monthly. But I still want to wear them while I'm paying on them. And I'm willing to pay extra for them. I'm willing to pay for them $20 a month plus taxes to pay the first four months to only be interest on the shoes. Do you understand what I'm saying? This is crazy. Do you realize how crazy you sound right now to even be considering this? Leasing a shoe. Oh, I want to see what they do when they have to repossess the shoes. Come right up on your ass at the club. Uh, uh, excuse me. Um, excuse me. Hey, what's up, man? Uh, is your name Jaquan Anderson? Who wants to know? Uh, I do. Um, I'm here from a firm. Uh, is your name Jaquan? Yeah, my name's Jaquan. What's up? Um, sorry, Jaquan. You're, you're late on your J's payment. I'm going to have to take those. And I could just see it now. You had to fight to keep the shoes on your feet. You're going to get a charge if you don't get them shoes up. So now you got to walk home in stocking feet because you wanted to do a firm, wanted to, wanted to buy your shoes through a firm instead of just buying you some Converse, Converse or some regular old Nikes, some old, some old, I don't know, some wearing some flip flops or something. But no, you you had to get the J's. Listen, listen. Jordan's not everything. They're not everything. In fact, they're no thing. They overpriced. They overhyped. And now they're overvalued by you. You sound crazy. We got people out here who are willing to go into debt to buy a pair of shoes. And they won't spend money on things they need, like better food, so they live longer. Better quality food. And I'm not saying you not buying those J's is going to change your entire outlook, financial outlook. No, it probably won't. But it won't help. And if you had another way that you could spend $300 or $400, or well, after paying with this thing, maybe $500, I don't know, what this interest will pile up to if you keep missing payments. Do you realize anybody who puts you in debt, a debt where you own a depreciating asset like a shoe? <laughs> God, I can't even believe I'm saying That person is not your friend. And I dare anyone from a firm to come on my show and explain to me how you are a friend to poor 
in lower class or working class or students. I would, I wait, I dare to come on my show and prove that to me. How your program, how your little niche freaking app helps these people. Keep your money in your pocket. 